Hey everyone, welcome back. Day three of seven simple steps to holding more pots. Now, we live in an information fueled world. I am giving you information. Please, please, please don't do what a majority of people do. Get the information and never apply it. I promise you, promise you that this will help you hold more pots. It's not only scientifically proven to help, I have seen it. I have seen these strategies work with junior golfers, elite junior golfers, collegiate players, tour professionals, and most importantly, hundreds of club golfers. But it only works with the ones that believe in it and stick to it. So please, please, please apply what we learned on day one. Take a look at the putt from the low point. Try and gauge a read with your feet. Please work on your breathing and tension control to allow you to access a better, more free-flowing, more natural stroke that will help your speed control. And please do this today. Today, what we're gonna learn is awesome. Step number three, it's called quiet eye. Quite simply, amateur golfers' eyes when they read the putt are not as disciplined as professional golfers. And what I mean by this, if we take two pots, so there's hole number one, there's hole number two. Hole number two belongs to a pro, hole number one belongs to an amateur golfer. There's the golf ball. Now, as the amateur golfer's eyes go down to the target, the eye pattern looks like this. It jumps all over the place. The professional golfer's eye pattern looks a lot more like this. The pro is focused, laser focused on what they want to achieve. The amateur golfer's eyes are not as quiet. So, I loved this research when I first saw it, and then I created some awesome drills that have helped hundreds of people practically apply this. Remember, the practical application is so important. Practically apply this, and ultimately begin to hold more pots. So, very simple. Let's get out there, let's get to the putting green, and let's work on step number three, quiet eye. So, remember what I said inside. Professionals' eyes, they almost burn a laser line down to the hole. Amateurs' eyes, all over the place. So what you'll see with a lot of amateurs is when they're looking at a putt, What you'll see with a pro is more like this. Very precise and deliberate with their eye movements. So, we're gonna train that. Quite simply, say what you see. Very, very simply. Have your putt. My eyes are looking at the ball, I'm gonna say ball. My eyes are looking at target, I'm gonna say target. My eyes are looking at the line of the pot, I'm gonna say line. Ball, ball, line, line, line. Target, target, line, line. Ball, 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 line, line, line. Target, target, line, line. Ball, ball. Okay, that felt great. Felt really target focused. Felt like nothing else penetrated my mind. So that's the simple drill that we're gonna do today. And that's gonna help you train the evidence-based, scientifically proven process of quiet eye. Now, just like before, guess what we gotta do? We gotta piece it all together. So you might wanna change hole. If you don't change hole or the putting green's busy, at least like I did yesterday, change angle. So I'm gonna change angle, I'll come more here. 
So, step one, taking more information. Look at the putt from the side, get more of an idea of distance, feel it in my feet. Look at it from behind. Keep looking at that perspective, get as much information as possible. Now this time I'm not going to do the tension drill, I'm just going to be aware of it. So breathe. Okay, I want to feel level 1.5 in my hands. Level 1.5 in my hands. Level 1.5 in my hands. Feels really good. Now, ball, ball, ball. Target, 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 target. Line, line. Ball, ball, ball. Target, 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 target. Target, line, line, line. Ball. Felt so good. So, awesome process. So again, we're not bothered about performance right now. What we're bothered about is learning the process. So take day one, day two, day three, start to put it together when you're comfortable with day three's exercise and take the steps that you need to start holding more putts.